Now with the weather, here's Paul Higgins. And Sam, we're in for a bit of a mixed bag of weather over the next little while. Dry tomorrow in Melbourne, but it will be wet and windy on Thursday. It was the coldest morning of the year at Echuca, Hopeton, Kyabram, Mildura, Shepparton and Swan Hill. Minus temperatures in all those places, or negative temperatures, I suppose is better English, isn't it? There were some high clouds today in the west, partly cloudy across central and eastern parts. Malakuta, Mildura and Orbost all reached 18 degrees, but bare Stale in Victoria's Riviera went one better with 19. We actually ended up with more sunshine than was forecast today in Melbourne, enough to push the city high to 16.8 at 2.20 this afternoon. Outside now it is back to 12 degrees. Perth had some showers late today, thunderstorms nearby as well, down as low as minus 8 at Cooma, New South Wales this morning. That's because a large high is sitting over the east, so they've got clear skies there and light winds. There's a uh, trough and cold front of the nation's southwest. That front is going to race across the bite tomorrow to be in Victoria on Thursday. It'll become windy here tomorrow as that front gets closer and those isobars squash up there. And then on Thursday, a band of rain will cross the state, around 5 to 10 millimetres of it, and there'll be a blast of colder air as well. Tomorrow, sunny in Sydney and Brisbane, and in Canberra and Adelaide, mostly sunny. Perth will have some morning showers. Hobart should be partly cloudy. Back home. Another night of single-digit lows, although it stays in positive figures out of the mountains. Some very isolated showers near the coast and ranges and some patchy morning fog expected in the northeast. There is a frost warning for the Mallee, northern country, northeast and east Gippsland and a warning of sheep graziers in the north central, northeast and central districts plus Gippsland. A northerly wind on the bay, 15 to 30 knots, so strong winds on Port Phillip along with the west and the central coasts. Down to 9 degrees in Melbourne tonight, getting up to 17 tomorrow. That's the same as today, but it'll feel quite a bit cooler out in the fresh northerly wind. It'll be a partly cloudy day. Windy on Thursday and it will be cloudy with rain mostly from mid to late morning and a colder westerly wind in the afternoon, getting up to 17 before that arrives. Friday cloudy with a shower or two, especially in our southeast, and just 14. Saturday cloudy with a possible shower, a northwesterly wind and 16. Showers on Sunday, it'll be cloudy with a north and northwest wind 15, still a shower or two on Monday and a cloudy Tuesday, Tam. Thank you, Paul. That's it for this evening's bulletin. Sarah Ferguson is up next.